Hi, welcome back with me Plant Do Home and Garden. This time, I'll show you video about best plants for pots outside front door. Well, before go to the video, don't forget to like and subscribe for supports this channel. Also, you can turn on the bell for more updated videos. Okay, let's go to the video. Think your home's entrance needs a little sprucing up? Here are the best plants for pots outside your front door. These are perfect if you want to add a touch of nature or bright splashes of colors to liven up your porch or doorstep. But make sure they're big enough so people will instantly notice them. And they need to have something that makes a nice first impression. To help you do that, consider the lovely plants below. They're all of different types so you can choose what kind you prefer. Number 1. Marigold. Marigolds are amazing in containers because it causes the plant to become compact. As a result, you're able to see its blooms stand out ever more from the leaves. Its blooms are no doubt its most attractive features. Yet despite this, they are easy to grow and can adapt to conditions easily. Do note that there are many different types of marigold around. Each of them with distinctively different looking flowers. For example African marigolds look like pom-poms, which make their blooms look fluffy. French marigolds are more prolific. As a result, they can become more bushy. This not only gives you the choices of many different bright colors, but also looks as well. Number 2. Hydrangea. Speaking of looks, it is almost impossible to miss. These flowering shrubs are known for their showy blooms that look like individual puffs of colored clouds. You have the option of going with blue, pink, white, green, red or purple depending on what look you're going for. They can grow to as big as 15 feet on the ground, but are more manageable when kept in containers. Nevertheless, they'll look their best when you allow them to get bushy and overflow around the edges of the pot. Number 3. Begonia. Begonias are another wonderful flowering plant to grow in pots. Note that there are many different types of begonias, and they all look different. So, you do want to select the blooms that represent the look you're going for the most. In fact, while begonias are most known for their flowers, there are a few amazingly stunning foliage begonias you may consider as well. In general, these don't have blooms that are as big as hydrangeas. However, they make up for that as number and darker, brighter hues. Number 4. Boxwood. Speaking of foliage, boxwood are well-known evergreen shrubs that can grow thick and tall. This makes them popular for hedges, low fences and privacy screen. You do want to choose the dwarf varieties, since these grow to between 2 and 8 feet high when planted in the ground. As such, they're much smaller in containers. However, you can likewise keep them in large pots to take advantage of the lovely shapes you can make from them. Boxwood are mostly green. Although you'll see some that are more yellow. They enjoy full sun, but can tolerate part shade, which makes them perfect for the pots on your entryway or doorstep. Number 5. Sweet Alyssum. In case you want something more subtle or classical looking, consider sweet alyssum. Officially, they're carpets of small flowers. White is popular. Although, you can opt for purple if you want some extra color. Or pink if you want something in between. Number 6. Ferns. Ferns are foliage plants that give you another dimension. While they're mostly composed of leaves like the boxwood, they give you a completely different look because of how they're fronds. Additionally, they are resilient, require little care, and are hard to kill. Thus, they're very popular indoor plants, and you'll see lots of them in offices, commercial building reception areas, and even hotels. Because there are over 12,000 different species, you do want to pick out what you want. Often, ferns will have varying shaped fronts, Number 7. Cactus. Cactus come in all shapes and sizes. And because you're going to display them in your front door, 
you want to skip the small indoor cacti that are mostly for tabletop decor. Instead focus on garden cacti which are bigger. These easily adapt to being grown in containers. And, they'll be big enough for visitors to appreciate. The best part about cacti is their very low maintenance. This means infrequent watering, no pruning, and you can neglect them quite a bit without any issues. Thanks for watching my video about best plants for pots outside front door. If you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe for supports our channel. Well, see you in the next videos.